People ask, what do I like most about Chris? And I think one of the things that I like most about her- You better say the right thing right now. I'm very nervous. There's no pressure. <laughs> um, is I, I've always loved Chris's passion. Chris is passionate about everything. Um, she's passionate about the lost. She's passionate about church. She's passionate about our kids. She's passionate about everything. Um, that, and the passion that you see on stage is the same passion that is in the midst of every conversation, um, every interaction, all that sort of stuff. So she's congruent uh, and consistent in that she is passionate all the time, which is awesome. Are you saying like when I wake up, I'm passionate? Yeah, yeah <laughs> like she she wakes up with this, this intensity and she used to actually ask questions um, in bed, like, hey, da 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 da, and, I'd go, and I would be silly enough to try and answer them from a state of semi-sleep. So now I just say, no questions till after coffee. He says there's only two S's allowed in bed, and one is sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> Nick, what will be the most annoying part about being married to Chris Kane? You know, you better tread very carefully. It's been a good 25 years. <laughs> I was going to say the most annoying thing is the same as the thing that I love most about you. It's your passion. You're passionate about everything. So it doesn't matter how wrong you are, you're equally passionate about your viewpoint. You're equally passionate about why why isn't the garbage out already? It's like, because there's only three things in the garbage bag. Um, so the- Did you say, did I hear you say that when I'm wrong, it doesn't matter how wrong I am about something? Yeah. Right, okay. How frequently is that an issue? That's a matter of interpretation. <laughs> Ha 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 ha!